Hi, this is Shadi and today we're gonna see the benefits of training kata and also the benefits of situational awareness and situational training when it comes to self-defense. So what we're gonna be looking at today is a military drill. This is something that's very frequently done by the Japanese military. So it is very important to train judo in such a way in my opinion. So it's a hostage situation that is designed. You have someone flailing a gun at the police while they're trying to calm him down. And then from the blind side, from the hostage side, because the arm cannot rotate fast enough where the hostage is creating some type of shield, you can actually go in from that blind side and execute Ippon Saranage. So you see the arm is stretched out. Uh, as you see it in kata and also as you see it uh, in a lot of competitions when someone is trying to reach down uh, your back and from there you apply the technique and the uh, assailant is neutralized. So here you see nage no kata, you have the arm, it is stretched out looking to strike downward and Nage no kata, in my opinion, holds a lot of teachings. It's showing you that you can attack judo from standard grips like sleeve and lapel. Also from the strikes, you can also attempt throws like uranage and seoenage. And also you can attack from over underhook. And this is the goal here. But in the hostage uh, scenario, the arm was simply stretched out to the front which makes it all the more easier to execute Ippon Serenage. Now, um, there's also one thing that is taught regarding this technique is that you have to grab the arm firmly. Uh, a lot of people in competition, you see them doing this, even the highest and world champions, you see them doing such a technique. Scores Ippon nonetheless, but the way to fully execute it and the way to fully trap their arm is to actually really pin it to your shoulder and actually grip the top of their shoulder and cut down like you're cutting with a sword. So if you have anything else to add, please let me know down below. Also consider supporting me on Patreon for exclusive content. This was Shady and thank you for listening.